Hello guys, how are you today? I will teach you how to install ASC Kia DHCP v4 server on Ubuntu 22.04 with Stork dashboard. First, if you are new to my channel, please subscribe my channel. Now let's start the video. I have a Word file with complete information, so I copied command one by one and paste. Copy sudo apt install curl app transport https y press enter. Now we add the isc kia repository. Copy the ISC Kia repository curl one slf https colon slash slash dl dot cloudsmith io slash public slash isc slash kia dash two dash six slash setup dot deb dot sh sudo e bash and press enter. After adding the repository, once run the system update command. sudo apt update. After having the repository added successfully, run the given command that will install the KEA DHCP4 and KEA DHCP6 along with the KIA control agent and KIA DHCP DDNS server packages. Pseudo apt install isc kia copy that and paste and press enter. After completing the installation successfully, let's check what version of KEA DHCP is on our system. Kia DHCP 4 version. 2.6.1 is a stable version of Kia. After that we check the service and confirm it is running without any error. Use system for status ISC Kia DHCP 4 server and enter you can see ISC Kia DHCP server service up and running. To enable the DHCP v4 service to start on boot copy. sudo system to enable ISC Kia DHCP 4 server. Before performing any changes to the DHCP configuration file of KEA, Let's take the backup of its original file. sudo mv slash etc slash kia slash kia dhcp4.conf slash etc slash kia slash kia dhcp4.conf box. Now, create the configuration file in your preferred text editor. sudo nano slash etc slash kia slash kia dhcp4.conf I already have a file with basic settings so I copy the text and paste in that I this file I put the information about interface which I am using, information. About Kia database which I configure later, default subnets and some hooks that it's.
Now we install the Postgres database first for my Kia DHCP4 server to my data. Copy apt install PostgreSQL press enter. Switch to the Postgres user. Sue Postgres. Then connect to the PostgreSQL with the administrator user. Copy PSQL Postgres. Now we will create the database for the Kia DHCP4 server and the specific user. Create user Kia with password Kia. Create database Kia. Grant all privileges on database Kia to Kia. Now copy backslash C Kia. Copy create extension P crypto, press enter. Now we can leave PostgreSQL and switch back to the root user. You can do this just by using exit. Now we will create the database for the Stork server and the specific user. Create user stork with password stork. Create database stork. Grant all privileges on database Kia TO stork. Now we can leave PostgreSQL and switch back to the root user. You can do this just by using exit. First we need to update our repositories. If you are not working as root you have to run the command as followed. 
curl one slf https colon slash slash dl dot cloudsmith io slash public slash isc slash dork slash cfg slash setup slash bash dot deb dot sh pseudo bash Now we can install the Stork server. Copy apt install isc Stork server. To run the Stork server we have to edit the default configuration file. You can find it here. Copy slash etc slash stork slash server dot env. Now uncomment the following line stork database host equals local host. Stork database port equals 5432. Stork database name equals stork. Stork database username equals stork. Stork database password equals stork. Stork rest host equals 0.0.0.0. Stork rest port equals 8080. Stork log level equals info. That's it. You can move on install the Stork agent here, we're going to use the official repositories. So, we need to add it on the machine. curl one slf https colon slash slash dl dot cloudsmith io slash public slash isc slash stork slash cfg slash setup slash bash dot deb dot sh pseudo bash. Copy sud apt install isc stork agent. Copy sudo nano slash etc slash stork slash agent dot env. Uncomment the following line. Stork agent host equals 127.0.0.1. Stork agent port equals 8081. Stork agent listen stork only equals false.
Stork agent server URL equals HTTP forward slash forward slash localhost 8080. Stork log level equals info. Now we copy the path of Kia PostgreSQL database. Stork underscore agent underscore db underscore url equals postgresql of forward slash forward slash kia kia at localhost slash kia. Save the file and restart the services of Stork agent. System called restart isc stork agent dot service. And check the status also which is up and running. To enable automatic startup of the agent service and launch it now. Pseudo system to enable isc stork agent. Same for to enable stork server service and that restart the service and check the status. Now open the web browser before that check what is my system IP address using IP add command. Type HTTP a forward slash forward slash 192.168.100.216 colon 8080 and press enter. By default username password for Stork is admin admin. Set new password for admin user. Save the new password in Stork dashboard registered the unregistered machine. Go to action and authorize the local host machine. Here you can see which services are running on and also see the app version DHCP v4 DHCP v6 DDNS and CA up and running on this machine. Hooks which I configure in DHCP file also installed here. Subnets which I mentioned in DHCP file also configure here. If you like my work please subscribe my channel. Goodbye.